This is the pillowcase. This is the pillowcase. The screaming into a pillow count as a suicide attempt because I smothered my voice. Trying to suppress a deep inner sound of reason, I caged something that needed to be free. I took the life out of my words, shackled my beliefs, tortured my spirit, killing the chance for release. I temporarily cut power to a ventilation system my inner being needs to breathe. With such disgrace, how did I carry on? Covering up my face rather than sounding the alarm. Forehead to chin, meshed against the pillowcase. Who exactly was harmed? The man whose hands crammed oppression down his own throat and suffocating his tears and shame of feeling vain? Or was it the soulmate who never got the call, confessing the will for their love to remain? The vocal cords bore into a soft, dead, broken, cotton microphone mask, hollering unheard, embraced by dark clouds in the soft cracks of thunder with my brain. His thoughts get checked with the base of disdain and wells up in the belly and this toxic to contain. I've swallowed more than pride. I've swallowed my lies and didn't want to see it, so I covered my eyes. I didn't know how to tell it, so I sought my demise in a pillowcase in my attempt to confide, covering my ears to silence my cries. Pillowcase.